Hey everybody. In this video I'm going to talk about how computer power supplies discharge themselves that way you can work in them later on after you unplug them. Anytime you look at a power supply, um, when you look at the label, you will typically see something like this. It will say, caution, do not remove this cover. It will tell you something like there's high voids inside the power supply. This little advisory there. Well, that's definitely the case because in power supplies, you get your 120 volts in, and after rectification, you get the peak value of that um, voltage. And in this double circuit, you pretty much double that to about 300 to 350 volts or so. So we're talking about extremely high voltage there, lethal voltage. And we have these two main capacitors there that act as a buffer between your rectification and your main switchers here. Now, um, when you unplug a computer power supply, it's usually it's best to wait at least a few hours, if not up to probably a day before you work inside one. And that's to give the power supply time to discharge. Now, of course, obviously the um, load from you know all this here will discharge the caps, but there's also bleeder resistors, and those are located right down in there. You can see one there to the crack, and there's another one that's facing about 90 degrees the other direction. These are placed right near where your varistors go. Seeing this is a cheaper in power supply, it doesn't have those varistors in there, so you see where VZ2 is at, I believe. Yep, VZ2. In this area is where your varistors will normally get installed, but you can see, probably see those bleeder resistors in there. This is what makes a power supply safe to work in after about a, let's say after a few hours or so, because these resistors um, actually um, are connected to these capacitors between you know the voltage source and ground that way these capacitors will be discharged after a certain amount of time so if you was ever wondering what made your computer's power supply safe to ever work in after being unplugged that's how it, that's actually how it works so anyways you can see I've been working a lot on power supplies <laughs> there's stuff everywhere but anyways and the question or comments, feel free to ask and thanks for watching.